Let me get some information off you. So I couldn't put your mom because she's here. Did you guys get caught like doing the same thing or what? No, we weren't doing the same thing. We were in the same store, but we weren't in the same together. And my mom said she had put some stuff in her purse and I was looking at the baby stuff. So when the lady told her something, like she just came at her, I heard her arguing with my mom. So I started arguing with the lady at the, at the store. So that your mom could take off? No, 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 because I didn't know my mom had done that. And she called the cops and everything. When he pulled us over and stuff, um, my mom, she had her purse with her. She never told me she had it. She said, I admitted to him, okay, I do have it. And she gave it to him. She gave it to the officer. What was she stealing? Or what was in it? She was up a couple of stuff because she, she didn't have no more money. And she she forgot to pay for it. No, she didn't forget to pay for it, but she just had a low on money. Oh, she intended to take it without paying for it. I thought maybe she walked out and she just forgot to pay for it. Oh, no. She, she actually, she took it because she didn't have yeah, enough she money. Confessed, to... Yes. She was, she was running low and we have a baby shower on Saturday and she wanted to get a couple of things for my niece. But you didn't know about it. Or no, you knew I about didn't. it. Kind of guilty by association. Yes. Because you guys were together. Unfortunately, it was your mom. It was my mom. It was my mom. And she confessed and she said she's sorry and everything. She will never do it again. She said it's the first time and it's her last time. Well, I'm sure now <laughs> they have you as a, a deaf class C. So, Under 50, yeah. It's a so misdemeanor. It's a, it's a misdemeanor. And they gave you a bond of $500. So you didn't expect that from her. I told her, Mom, did you have no more money? She's like, I'm like, she's like, well, we had ten dollars. You should have told me, Mom. I would have paid for it. That's what happened. And it would have been case closed, walked case out, closed, and yeah. you know, but you guys wouldn't be here together. Yes, yes, that's the case. But all right then. So you know, go ahead and have a seat right there, and we'll go ahead and get your paperwork and everything processed, and then uh, okay, so thank you. the other side. Ma'am, you're you're the mom. Yes, I'm the mom. What yes. happened here? I just made a bad choice. I just decided to just... And I had money in my pocket. I just decided to just take some stuff from the store. And ma'am, is there anything you really want to tell your mom? Tell my mom, you know, and, I, and it wasn't right and everything, but I forgive her, you know, and it, it's something that she did out of impulse. She's not like that. It was a mistake. You know, it hurts more for her than it does me because she got me in trouble. And it, it's not really... That's my mom. I don't do that. It's my mom and I my daughter. No, she doesn't. She does everything for us. my daughter, they're my best friends, you know? Yeah, she is my best friend. And then it's going to get us closer, too. And then we can, you know, we're in jail together. Not taking things for granted. I mean, a mom and a daughter in jail together. I mean, we've been through a lot already. And this is what we have to learn. We have that communication. And that's what gets us through. Well, that's important. That's important. Oh, we don't care. Thank you. Well, I mean, you guys learned from it. Now you just got to make sure everything works out for you guys yes. and uh, get and things square. Well and, uh, We're both going to go to jail. Absolutely. Okay. Okay. Excellent, guys. Good luck to you guys, okay? Well, this is probably, hopefully, the last sound of the doors slamming behind them they hear. They seem like they've bonded. It's a bonding experience here at jail, too.